These are the only two things you need in life. Cable tie, WD-40. If you want it to move and it doesn't, use this. If you don't want it to move and it does, use this. So we've got um, some brand new studs here, washers and nuts for, for the carb. I'm going to stick that on now. We've got some brand new gaskets. Brand new gaskets. So uh, today's the day I'm going to fit the carb. Now, I managed to get the standard factory settings of the carb. So here's your idle adjustment screw, one there and one on the other side, on that side. And basically, they're supposed to be set from factory. Factory setting is out one and a half turns. Um, whatever you do on one side, you do it on the other. Now these, one was set at a quarter turn out and the other was set at two turns out. So everybody's always told me that um, this doesn't really run very well, this transit. It doesn't run great. It uses a lot of fuel. Well, the carbs are completely imbalanced there. Um, also, if you notice here, so this, that there, and that one there that's your sight screw so you're supposed to take those out and this is your fuel bowls on either side twin bank fuel bowls you take those plugs out effectively and you rock it when it's on the engine so you rock the whole engine and it should just you should get fuel spilling out of here now because somebody's broke that off i can't do that and i can't see how much i've got with just the fuel bowl so what we're going to do is we're going to test fit it see how see how it runs hopefully Fingers crossed it runs. See how it gets on. Um, <clears throat> and ultimately take it from there. But I've reset everything else to uh, factory settings and um, cleaned it all out as best I can. So yeah, let's get fitting. Moment of truth. Let's see if she leaks everywhere. Oh. I can hear the fuel pump. Oh, it sounds like she's filling up. Well, that's a positive, considering I've not even got a Jubilee clip on it. Right. Let's see what happens. There we go. I don't know how long it is since this thing started, but I've never heard it run. Who buys a car that they haven't seen run, eh? Right.
fuel. So that is no brake cleaner in there. It's a bit smoky around here, mine. Good, I think. No engine management light on, look. She's ticking over. She's literally ticking over on her own fuel. I'm impressed. Now we find out all the problems. Okay, so she's running. She, well, well he is Reggie. Managed to get him to start. Uh, I can get the gearbox into all the forward gears. So it'll go into drive two and one, and I can put it back into neutral. But I can't get it, I can't seem to get it into reverse. Carb needs fine tuning. Um, whilst it was running up to temperature, I found a couple of coolant leaks as well. So this is going to be good fun. Um, yeah, I'm glad it runs. Got it going. Uh, carb is definitely going to need tweaking and playing with. Um, and it moved. It moved under its own steam, which was good. I'd like to have got the. I'd like to have got the spec going, but do you know what? That's another video. Um, so yeah, uh, positive. I think.